Welcome back to the Deep Six Wrestling Podcast. This is actually streaming exclusively on our YouTube channel. So welcome back to the YouTube channel, or welcome to our YouTube channel for the first time. I'm Pat of the Deep Six Wrestling Podcast. I normally host our uh, weekly AW shows, but uh, as I've been trying my best to get into stardom this year with the World Climax events coming up this weekend, I figured I would do a little rundown of the shows um, for the YouTube channel. Uh, some new content. Uh, if you are a returning viewer, you'll notice we have a new intro. We've updated the graphics on the channel. If you follow us over on Twitter, we've also updated our graphics there. And our podcast episodes now have distinct uh, artwork. So, lots of rebranding going on here. We'll see how it goes moving forward. But if you're new here, please consider subscribing to the YouTube channel. We'd greatly appreciate it. You can also check out our podcast the links are all in the episode description uh or the description for this video i should say uh since i'm not actually recording for our podcast feed but we're on all streaming services pretty much so you can find us on spotify apple google stitcher tune in overcast you name it and you can follow us over on twitter if you'd also like um but i'll leave that uh, as is so the stardom world climax events i believe this is a big deal because this is stardom's first two-night pay-per-view event um so it's split into two nights uh and we have stardom world climax which is the first one is stardom world climax the best uh i apologize for the sound in the background the uh the garbage people uh are currently in my neighborhood i chose the worst time to record i'm sorry but um stardom world climax the best is tomorrow uh march 26th or it'll be today when you're listening to this possibly um and the card we have is the Future of Stardom Championship uh, match with Hanan taking on her sister, Rina. Uh, a singles match between Saya Aida and Marai of uh, DDM. A six-woman tag gauntlet match with um, Mina Shirakawa, Waka Tsukiyami. Uh, I'm still new to star- Stardom, so I apologize for butchering any names. Um, Sukiyama, not, not Tsukiyami. Um, Momokogo, um, who's from Stars and not Cosmic Angels, uh, and then we have Himeka, uh, Nasupoi, and Mai Sakurai, um, as another team, um, Saki Kashima, Fukujin Death, and Ruaka, and then, uh, Azumi, Lady C, and X, a mystery person who I've seen a lot of people are speculating as a new signing, um, again, I'm not too well versed in stardom yet, but I'm hoping to change that. Uh, we have uh, DDM versus Prominence. This is like a cross promotional match. DDM is represented by Micah and Tekla versus Risa, Sarah, and Suzu Suzuki. Uh, the goddesses of Stardom Championship are on the line with Hazuki and Kaguma defending against Momo Watanabe and Starlight Kid. Uh, then we have Mayu Iwatani and the returning Kairi, formerly Kairi Sane in WWE, taking on Tom Nakano and Unagi Sayaka. And then, basically, a double main event here. You have the Wonder of Stardom Championship with Saya Kamatani versus Utami Hayashishida. And the World of Stardom Championship with Shuri taking on Julia. Some uh, inter-faction warfare there with uh, DDM. And I do know uh, that there is likely a split coming with Dona Del Mundo. um, With uh, Shuri and Julia, you know, uh, most likely going their separate ways. 
Uh, so I guess, again, I have absolutely no clue if I'm going to be anywhere close on these predictions, but we'll go through. I'll just predict these matches, and then we'll go to night two. Um, so, uh, future Stardom Championship, Hanan versus Rina. Um, I don't think I've ever actually seen Rina wrestle, so I'm just going to choose Hanan, because uh, I've seen her wrestle. I think she's uh, pretty good for, you know, a 17-year-old. Um, so, I'm just going to go for her to retain. Why not? Uh, Saya Aida versus Mirai. Uh, the first time I saw Saya was at the... I saw her match at the New Blood show. Um... And I, I believe that was, like, her return match because she was injured. Um, I think she had a pretty cool look. Um, kind of reminds me of uh, Jordan Grace in Impact. Um, so, uh, that's cool. Um, I'm just going to go for... I feel like Mariah's probably going to win. I'd like to see Saya win. I think she's cool. Um, I don't really have an opinion on Mariah. Um, but I think Mariah's probably going to win. Uh, six woman tag gone the match. Um, I have no clue, but I'm just gonna go with Queen's Quest since they have a new member debuting. It seems. Um, so sure, uh, Azumi Lady C and X is my pick for this one. Um, it is still weird to see that like Momo Kogo is uh with um Cosmic Angels in this one, but uh, it is what it is. Um, <clears throat> DDM versus Prominence. I will say. Uh, since getting into stardom at the beginning of this year, Tekla has been like my breakout star of the year. I think this woman is absolutely fantastic with everything she does. Um, she looks like a, just a fantastic like addition to the roster as like the one Gaijin wrestler. Um, I thought her little feud with Mina Shirakawa over the SWA belt was really cool. I like their match. I like their feud. Um, just, you know, a fun addition to the roster. And... Uh, probably a contender for me for uh, when we do our deep six awards later this year to be breakout star of the year so pretty cool on tecla and stardom for giving her this uh you know position um prominence again i'm not really too familiar with them but um i'll go with uh prominence yeah we'll go with, i'm gonna go with prominence here picking up the dub um I also do know that Stardom likes doing, um, uh, what do you call it? Time limit draws. So maybe this will be a time limit draw where, uh, that's how they protect both teams. But I would say Prominence is more likely to win. The Goddesses of Stardom Championship, Hazuki and Kaguma versus Momo and Starlight Kid. Um, I think Starlight Kid is one of the brightest young wrestlers on the face of the earth. Um, I also really like Hazuki and Momo's great too. And Kaguma's fun. So, I'm excited for this one. This uh, this should be a fun tag match. I'm actually going to go for a title change here. I'm going to go with Oedo Tai. Uh, Momo and Starlight Kid picking up the dub. And I think they will become the new goddesses of stardom uh, champions. I'd be uh, I'd be down for that. You know, uh, Starlight lost her title to Izumi. And uh, I think this would be a nice little way to um, move forward with her uh, as a new champion. And it would also give Momo something. So, uh, and I also just feel like, you know, they'd be a really good team to put these titles on. So, Momo and Starlight Kid would be my pick on this one. Our tag team match here with uh, Mayu Iwatani and Kairi, all caps now, uh, taking on Tom Nakano and Unagi Sayaka. I think this is probably a lock for everybody that uh, Kairi and Mayu are winning this. Um, and since Tom has a title match the next night, I think it's also pretty clear that Unagi will be taking the pin. Um, regardless, I'm excited for this because I absolutely loved Kairi Zane um, in NXT. Uh, not so much on main roster. I mean, once she like turned heel with um, once her and Asuka turned heel, I thought they got pretty entertaining. But when she first came up and they just paired her with Asuka and Paige as the Kabuki Warriors, it was not good to say the least. So um i'm i'm happy that she's back and um this is going to be her first match in almost two years i think uh so that's kind of crazy um so we'll see how she is um i know that she it has been announced that she's going to be using her old stardom theme the last voyage uh which i have never heard because i did not watch stardom before this year <laughs> so 
Um, but I'm excited because, again, I love Kyrie. Mayu's great. And I also really enjoy uh, Tom and Unagi from what I've seen. So, um, yeah. Kyrie and Mayu will, will 100% win this match. <laughs> Um, and then that takes us to our two final title matches, Saya Kamatani versus Utami. Um, I believe that the story of this is that Saya has never been able to beat Utami. Um, so I feel like there's a pretty strong chance that Saya finally does beat her. Although, um, you never know. So um, I went with one title change earlier. Um, I don't have, I, I have Shuri retaining in the main event, I think, maybe. Um, like, it all depends. Like, I don't see both of the, I don't see all the titles changing hands. Well, I, again, I said Hanan's going to retain. Um, but I don't see, like, back-to-back, like, your two top titles changing hands here. Especially because they're going to be defended on the next night, too, and that, like, I don't know. Um, man, I really... I don't. I don't know. This is this is kind of hard. Um, I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna go for. Yeah, I'm going to go for. Saya. Uh, no, Utami. I'm gonna go Uta- uh, Utami. Utami is actually my favorite wrestler in Stardom. Uh, so you know what? Let's not bet against her. Uh, Utami Hayashishida will walk out with the Wonder Stardom Championship. And that is my final prediction. And then the main event, Wonders uh, World of Stardom Championship, Shuri versus Julia. Since I said I don't see both of them changing, I really had to just take a second to think here. Um, I'm going to go with Shuri beating Julia. Um, and it'll be interesting to see how they handle, like, a, a split up or if just Shuri leaves or if, like, she takes some of the group with her. Um, I, I am curious to see how this plays out um, over the next little bit in, in Stardom to see what happens with uh, DDM. Um, and if Shuri just takes it over and Julia leaves, or if Julia just kicks out Shuri, or Shuri just leaves on her own and then starts a new faction. Um, so, yeah. But, again, I think this... Uh, I'm looking forward to the... Honestly, I'm looking forward to the last four matches. The, the tag team um, championship match, the tag match with Mayu and Kairi versus Tom and Unagi, and then uh, Saya versus Utami and Shuri versus Julia. All, all four of those should be really, really good. Um, and again, I love Tekla, so I'll be excited to see her on this show. Six woman gauntlet match. I have no real interest in, um, like I said, Saya versus Mirai, same thing. And I'll be curious to see Hanan versus Rina since again, they're sisters and I don't recall ever seeing Rina wrestle personally. Um, at least in a singles match. Maybe I've seen her in a tag. Um, so, yeah. Uh, but that is night one. So that is Stardom World Climax the best. So let's move over to Stardom World Climax the top. Uh, and if you hear more noise in the background, it is the blinds behind me fluttering as my, my cat, Nugget, is uh, trying to stare out the window. Oh, and now she's running away. Uh, she doesn't like being called out, I guess. Um Anywho, on March 27th, we have Stardom World Climax, the top. And the full card we have is uh, a future of Stardom Championship match with Hanan or Rina taking on uh, whoever wins the first night, um, taking on my Sakurai. The Cinderella Rumble um, with a bunch of people. Uh, Unagi, Mina, Lady C, uh, Miyu, Saki Kashima, uh, Ruaka, Saya Ida, Momokogo, uh, Sukiyama, uh, Tom- Tomooka Inaba, Aoi, Aoi, I, that, that's, I can't pronounce that, I didn't, my Japanese is not, um, not there, uh, Haruka Umasaki, Nanami, Maria, Ai Huzan, Mei Saruga, again, I, I know who that is, um, she's appeared on AEW before, so I, I am familiar with that name, because she, uh, was with Emi, uh, Emi Sakura, uh, Yuna Mizumori and more. So um, I I don't know who else to expect in this. If there's going to be anybody I I know, but uh, we'll see. I don't have a predict. I'm just gonna. You know, I mean, when I predict something, I'll just choose a random name here. I guess. Um, I don't know if this is like 
for anything. Um, so by the, that, I, like not knowing that can't really influence my my predictions. Um, I'm not familiar with like Stardom Rumble rules. Um, the loser of Saya Kamatani and, and Utami on the first night will take on Mirai. Um, Hazuki versus Momo Watanabe. Uh, the high speed championship is on the line with Azumi versus Kaguma versus Natsupoi uh, in a three way match. Uh, special singles match Kairi versus Starlight Kid. This is one I am so excited for. That should be awesome. Um, we have a DDM versus prominent match, uh, prominence match with the loser of Shuri and Julia teaming with Micah, Hameka, and Tekla. Taking on Risa, Sarah, Suzu Suzuki, Akane Fujita, and Moki Miyagi. Uh, then we have the Wonder of Stardom Championship. The winner of Saya and Utami taking on Tom Nakano. And the main event will be the winner of Shuri and Julia on night one facing off against Mayu Iwatani. Um, yeah. So, I'm, uh, I'm interested in this card as well. Um, you know, it, uh... Both these shows look pretty strong, to be honest. Um, in terms of matches I'm most looking forward to, I'd say Kyrie versus Starlight is very high up there. Um, Hazuki versus Momo should be really good. The high-speed three-way um, should be really fun. And again, both title matches, like at the, the, the semi and main event um, for the Wonder and World titles, both also could be very good. So... Uh, predictions wise, let's go through. Uh, I had Hanan retaining on night one. Um, maybe I'll do a title change on this one. Maybe have my soccer. I walk away with the belt, the with the future Stardom Championship. Why not? You know, you gotta get a bit risky sometimes. Um, she has, she is also like uh, you know freshly turned so. Um, Cinderella Rumble. <laughs> uh, let's go with... Uh, Jesus. Um, go with Momokogo. Why not? That'll that'll be my pick for the, uh, the Cinderella Rumble. I, I don't have high faith in that, but sure. Uh, the loser of Saya and Utami versus Mirai. So I had Utami on night one. So that would mean uh, Saya would be facing off against Mirai. And I said Mirai's most likely winning on night one. So um, whoever loses here, whether it's Saya or Utami, I would assume beats Mirai as like a rehab win. Um, Hazuki versus Momo. I'm going to go with Hazuki. Um, I had Momo and Starlight Kid taking the tag titles um, on the first show. So, I think Azuki could win this. Uh, high speed three way, I'm going to say Azumi retains. Um, she just got the belt from Starlight Kid. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go with Azumi. Singles match with Kyrie and Starlight Kid. Uh, I think Kyrie kind of has to win this. Um, although, you know, she's coming back. She's winning her first match guaranteed in that tag. So you could always have like a crazy upset here with Starlight Kid with Kyrie putting her over, but I, I would assume Kyrie wins this. Um, and you could always use this to get Kyrie like a a tag title shot if Starlight Kid and um, Momo actually do win on night one. Uh, the DDM match with uh, DDM versus Prominence. I'm I'm not actually too sure here because I can see you know you could go multiple ways here where. You know, um, if DDM kind of fails on night one and you're going to have this drama of the Shuri and Julia thing, you could have them lose here to cause more of a like dissension in the group and whatnot, or you could have them come out here and win to look strong. Um, I don't know. It's, it's This one is also kind of in the air for me. Uh, geez. Uh Oh, you know what? I'm going to go back. Kyrie and Starlight Kid, if... I think Kyrie wins, but I do think there's a chance that they do a time limit draw. This could be very much like a like a Cody, Darby Allen thing, where it's like their first match. Um, they did the time limit draw 
to really put over one to establish the time limit draw, but also just to put over that Darby Allen took Cody to the limit. I could see that with this where they could have um, Starly Kid take Kyrie to the limit. So we'll see. Um, but I did want to add that. Um, yeah, I have absolutely no clue in this, uh, this, this DDM prominence match. Um, I'll just go ahead and go with, uh, with, fuck, man. Um, uh, go prominence just to go with, like, more, um, dissension in, uh, DDM. And I would assume that you'll probably see lines maybe be drawn here in, like, a post-match angle, uh, maybe. Who knows? Uh, Wonder Stardom Championship, Saya or Utami? I chose Utami, so this would be Utami versus Tom. Um, I would kind of assume that Utami would just, you know, retain. Um, I feel like that just kind of makes the most sense to me. I don't know. Um... Unless, like, <laughs> um, shit. Uh, I'm gonna go with Utami retaining. Right. That feels right. Or would you would you do an actual like one day title reign? I don't know. Um, I do know that there's a history there, but again, I'm not uh, as well versed on it because, like I said, I only started watching Stardom this year, so I guess I'm booking or, or doing predictions with a with a handicap here. Um, but I'm gonna I'll just go with Utami to retain. Um, and then main event, uh, it would be Shuri versus Mayu for the World of Stardom Championship. I would have Shuri retaining here. Um, personally, that would just be my guess. Um, but Shuri versus Mayu should be a really great main event, to be honest. So, that's good. Um, yeah. So, that, uh, that kind of wraps it up. So, that's Stardom World Climax, the best and the top. Uh, that is, once again, my cat nugget, uh, attacking the blinds in the background. Um, thanks for joining me for this, uh, short little... 20 minute or so uh, preview rundown predictions of the stardom shows if you want more stardom content be sure to leave a like um, if you made it to the end of the video be sure to comment your predictions down in the comments just uh let me know who you think's gonna win you could also just leave a comment saying what match you're looking forward to the most um yeah uh if you enjoyed also consider subscribing to the channel go subscribe to our podcast feed and yeah um thanks for joining me uh for the first ever stardom video on the deep six wrestling channel and hopefully there's many more to come but until next time that's it for me and thank you for joining me for this special episode <laughs>